Yeah. All right. Let's make this quick. How to write the task three essay for the English regions? Yay! Here's the directions. Let me explain it. Read the text right here. Find the central idea. Here's my two-step process. What's the story about in one to two words? And what's the author saying about those one to two words? For example, love. That's not a central idea. What's the author saying about love? Love is amazing. That's a central idea. But you can't say the central idea is just love or death. Death brings people together. Death is inevitable. Those are themes. Death, one word, is not a theme. Moving on. Uh, then you gotta explain how one litter element shows the theme. What is one litter element? I feel sorry for you if you don't know what one litter element is. But look, the city is giving you all like 10 litter elements over here. All you have to do is take one of these and explain how it shows the center idea of that boring uh, essay you're gonna read. And then uh, explain how one litter element shows the theme using quotes. Yeah, obviously use quotes. How old are you? Moving on, three paragraph essay. Oh, three paragraph essay. Let me go over this three paragraph essay. Look, your girlfriend may ask you, and she'll say, Look, it's my birthday. I don't need anything. Get her something. The city's going to say, Write two to three paragraphs. Guess what? Write three paragraphs. If you write two paragraphs, you're going to fail. All right? Write three paragraphs. You can even write four. But if you write two, you're taking a chance, just like you're taking a chance by not giving your girlfriend a gift on Valentine's Day. Moving on, read the damn story. Bong. Skate. Skate. Ha. Outline the essay. Look, this is why we outline. It's like building a building, all right? You can't just build the windows and stuff. You need to have the structure. So. Here's my structure. Hot green tea turns to hook general statement thesis. Me eel turns into that. This sucker's done turns into that. And this thing turns into this. Now look, you may be thinking, why didn't I outline the intro first? Because you have to know what you're going to write in the body before you get to the intro. Okay, huh? It's like ordering dinner. You have to say, what am I ordering for dinner before I order the appetizer? Look, you can read, hopefully. Read this. And then I did the intro and conclusion. Look, it's an outline. See? It's a plan. I messed up. You don't know what these words mean? Look them up in the dictionary. Write the essay. I don't have time for this. 